Hi guys, uh, today I'm going to talk about the spinal reflex. Uh, basically the spinal reflex is an involuntary and automatic response uh, that occurs without any involvement of the brain. Uh, so for example, say I place my hand on something really hot or something really sharp. Uh, that sensory information would travel up my sensory neurons to my spinal cord. Uh, where it, when it hits the spinal cord, that information will be transferred to an interneuron and from there, the interneuron will straight away transfer that information to a motor neuron. The motor information will travel down a motor neuron, uh, immediately telling my hand to withdraw from, from the hot or the sharp object, for example. Uh, at the same time, that sensory information is still traveling up my spinal cord uh, to my brain, where I will feel pain. Uh, so you know if you place your hand on something really hot, you still feel the pain, uh, but this often happens after you've actually already withdrawn your hand. Uh, basically, the spinal reflex has evolved over time to allow us to have a faster reaction time and therefore protect us from something potentially damaging or potentially dangerous, uh, such as something really hot or something really sharp. So I hope this helps you understand the spinal reflex and best of luck.